Okay, firstly, I'd like to say Merry Christmas to everybody. Thanks for following these videos throughout the year. Um, please subscribe and please like these videos if you would like to see more. So, the first phrasal verb today that we'll look at is dress up. Dress up. You dress up for a special occasion or a party, and it means that you wear your best clothes. So, this girl is dressed up for a Christmas party, and she is dressed up as Santa. She is dressed as Santa, or maybe one of Santa's helpers. Okay, we look at the next picture, and we can see Santa Claus, Father Christmas. In this picture, Santa is coming down the chimney. He is coming down the chimney. He is climbing into the chimney and coming down it. He will give the children their presents. He will give out the presents. And then he will go back up the chimney. We use come down and go up for stairs also. You come down the stairs and you go up the stairs. So they're useful phrasal verbs. Okay, the next phrasal verb picture shows two people who are singing along to some music. You sing along when you sing to a piece of music which is being played maybe on the radio or maybe someone has a guitar or a piano and you are singing along to the music. So you sing along as well at Christmas time. The next phrasal verb picture shows a little girl who is putting up the decorations on the tree. So you put up decorations and you take them down maybe before the 1st of January, maybe a bit later in your family, I'm not sure. But you can put up the tree and you can take down the tree. You put up decorations and you take down decorations. Okay, the next picture shows a party and at the party you are meeting up with friends. You're meeting up with friends. So, meet up with, it just means meet someone by appointment, and it very often means a group of people. You very often use meet up with a group of people. So, I'm sure that you're all meeting up with your friends and family over the Christmas period. Okay, the next picture shows a girl who is hanging up her stocking. In England, the children hang up their stockings. Uh, on the 24th of December and they hope that Santa will fill up their stockings with presents. Okay, so they hang up their stockings. You can say put up the stockings also, just like the previous phrasal verb. And the opposite would be take down the stockings. Okay, the next picture shows Santa who is giving out presents to the family. Now, I give out presents to um, members of family when I sit, sit, sit under the tree, take the presents and give them out to different people. But teachers often give out homework. If they give out a worksheet, it means they give it to everybody in the class. So give out is when you give something to many different people at the same time. Okay? The last picture shows a girl who is wrapping up a present. So hopefully all of you have already wrapped up all of your presents for your family. And when the 25th of December comes, um, if the 25th of December is Christmas in your country, then you will unwrap your presents in the morning on the 25th. Okay, unwrap would be the opposite of wrap up. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed these phrasal verb pictures. If you have any questions about any of the pictures, please ask under the video and I will be delighted to answer them. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and please like this video if you'd like to see some more phrasal verb pictures. Thank you.